Hi everybody, it's Donna with Donna's Deals and DIYs. Hope you're having a great day. Happy Tuesday and welcome back for another devotional from A Little God Time for Women. Uh, today we are on page 74. And, oh, excuse me, 75, sorry. Um, this one's called Loss of Control. And it says, uh, the 120 is the last number she saw the needle pass on the speedometer. In one blinding instant, the wheel screeched, the glass broke, the pressure increased, the pain surged. All she could see was light and dark flashes and fear. All she could hear was the deafening silence, and all she knew with certainty was that she had lost control. Have you ever had a moment where you felt completely out of control? A car accident, a diagnosis, or some other frightening moment? There are instances in our lives when our own flesh fails us. We recognize in a flash that we are no longer in control of our own outcome, and it terrifies us. My flesh and my heart fail, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. Psalm seventy three twenty six. In that moment when control is lost and fear overcomes, there is one thing we can know for certain. He is our strength. God never loses control when your life and the outcome of it is ripped from your hands. It is still resting firmly in his grasp. He is our portion. He is our ration. He is enough. Release yourself today into the control of the only one who will never lose control. Yes, that is so good. Um, I just want to ask you to pray for uh, North Carolina and Florida. Again, um, there is another hurricane coming that way. I do have friends in Florida, and uh, I hope that they are safe, and I pray that they are. I have friends in North Carolina. I've reached out to some of our friends to see if they were evacuating or not. Um, Joanne is asking us to pray for her. She lives in that area. Um and so, please keep them in your prayers for protection and safety and rescue and provision um, all the way around. Because there's people in North Carolina that still need to be rescued and still need provision. And they need to start their lives all over again. So, they definitely need provision and protection. And I just appreciate you praying for them. And uh, I do have a description box with some more uh, in this video with more prayer requests, if you could please keep those in your prayers. If you have any prayer requests, uh, you can put them in the comments below. Or you can email me at platware at yahoo.com. If you need to know more about Jesus. Um, or if you have any praise reports, I'd love to hear from you. Please email me. Please hit the thumbs up and please share me out. I'd appreciate it. Remember that I love you. God loves you. And God bless you. Bye-bye.